A year since 70 National Guard soldiers left Oregon for Afghanistan, but now today they returned to the Rogue Valley. And they were welcome, welcomed home rather with an emotional ceremony in front of all their friends and family. NBC5's Cassie Nelson was at the Medford Armory as they were greeted by their loved ones. That's where she joins us live with more Cassie. That's right, hundreds of people were here earlier packing the Medford Armory for a very special welcome home ceremony. 70 soldiers from the 1st Battalion of the 186th Infantry returned home today, greeted by smiling faces at the Medford Armory. Some were even welcomed home by cuddles from newborn sons and daughters. First Lieutenant Patrick Reed even got to meet his baby boy Jack for the first time. Uh, I don't know. It's, oh, his eyes are open. Uh, it's just completely excited. I mean, I was... Uh, Definitely the happiest time ever, so, so this is my first firstborn. Patrick and his brother Andrew served side by side. It was nice to have family there. It's like having a little piece of home. <laughs> the soldiers were deployed to Afghanistan last July where they provided security missions. They were able to come home a little early due to continuous drawdowns. As you can imagine, family members were just as excited to see the soldiers return. Well, we didn't know how to take it when he said they were coming home. Uh, of course, the mom. My wife, Charlotte, she loved it. <laughs> you know? The rest of the battalion scheduled to return in June. And I asked a few of them, now what's the first thing you're going to do now that you're home? Among the answers, change into civilian clothes, plop down on the couch, watch TV with the family, barbecue, eat pizza, small everyday things that you and I might take for granted were things that they really missed while they were overseas. Live in Medford, Cassie Nelson, NBC5 News.